All right, so we got the back legs off both, uh, front legs off one because the shot went through the front legs of one. Back stakes up as far on that neck chops as we could go and a bit of flat. So we're pretty stoked. We almost run out of meat. I haven't been hunting in a while because my little dog Maverick ended up that cancer took her. So it's good to get out again, but it's a bit weird without her. Yeah, it's fucking pretty strange. But I'm wearing her neck thing, which still smells like her, so it's a bit strange, but it's good. She would have loved this hunt. Some pretty cool country through here. And this is where me and her shot that good stag, that fellow buck, last year. So it brings back a few memories. But yeah, it is what it is. We're gonna get back to camp, set up. We got lamb chops and sirloin steaks. Yeah, boy. New York style scotch. Just over here. Where did she go, eh? We've been sitting here for 10 minutes, seeing if she comes out again. She's gone. Still waiting for her to come out. <coughs> Who's B? come out again so we'll probably push up push down and get camp set up stoked it's a mean day up here love it get off there boy shout out B <laughs> gonna cut this camp it's only made for a single man not keen to hug this 
Whatever. Fag. You always fucking travel. Didn't on you say you're going to the big gay out, bro? <laughs> the bro even bought that Coke Zeros. But in my in my bag, I got them full fat cans. River. The full fat Coke. A classic. Dinner. This boy. Oh. <laughs> you fucking ratty prick. Oh god. Yuck. Oh, Do you reckon that was the cheese and crackers? Oh. It hurt, oh. hey? <laughs> I thought your farts would go. <gasps> <laughs> you cut this camp wider. It's going to be ruthless. <laughs> You're going to tighten, piece of shit. You're gonna tighten it, you full sack. This thing's shit, bro. <laughs> Aliexpress. How tight did you do that? I haven't touched it yet. Yeah, I might have seen something. You need. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a fuck about. What happened? There you go. <laughs> Good God! Look, I'm still imprinted. Piece of junk. We've tightened the spade too much. Yeah, I finally undid it. <laughs> Plumber grip, boy. Plumber's only. <laughs> oh. Are you sure there's not cocaine in there, Cookie? Holy. We finally got that spade undone. It took us probably an hour, maybe an hour and a half to cut the camp. And while we're cutting it, we I mean, we got a bit over the top with it. We ended up cutting like real nice seats. We cut drainage. We stopped probably halfway through to have lunch. That was good. We just had the, those hot and spicy shim rum yums or whatever they're called. It's like burned your lips and mouth. So it was pretty nice. And then we sat down glass for a bit and some deer walked out. So it was pretty lucky. By this point we're pretty jaded. We'd started we'd start walking in the morning at well I'd say five o'clock. It was now probably twelve or one o'clock. So yeah. Epic day for it though, so I was fucking stoked. Oh that's a good platform. I'm gonna cut me a seat just here. Only if we had a bourbon and not a fucking Coca Cola. Oh, fucking killing me. It's all broken scrub. I'm just gonna start glassing now. Hopefully, some more deer crews out. Some big uh, juicy scotch. Mm. A couple of chops. Mm. Cokes aren't really cutting it at the moment. Fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> Whose idea was it? <laughs> what the fuck is this? It's a fucking hot. <laughs> so I have to breathe, do you? <laughs> yeah. That'd be mean if you make a stew with that with a bit of dice vinny, eh? Damn, I'm sure saved the pack. Just seen those two deer, so we're just gonna try to set up both guns. And try and shoot one each. Yeah, they're just chilling in the bush there. And that ledge, another two tan one. That's fat, bro. What the fuck? Where's the other two? Back down on the ledge. Right on the ledge now. She's out. Yeah, I can see her now. I don't know. Fuck them. It's a. Uh, Mum and a fawn, bro. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, the rats are feed off, bro. Here, no, no, no. Oh, you go. Okay. Okay.
Now we opted uh, not to show the footage of those two deer cartwheeling down the hill. We ended up shooting the hind and the fawn. It's just some things I guess that don't look so pretty on film. So we watched them cartwheeling down that hill so they should be at the bottom of his gut here. Got our packs on. About to cruise down with my glass for a few more deer just in case. Your tuna helmet. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, hold on, bro. Uh, I'm filming here. Hold on, bro. Talk about the tuna. <laughs> yeah, glass all that for reds. Just use your reds on that face. Because I was shot at the top of that slip, and they tumbled down through here. I think she can smell them already, eh? There's one, oh no man, young hind. Buddy. Yes. Good girl. She must be on the other one. Good girl. There's one. She, she took quite a fall. This one was here and the other one just tumbled over the back. Oh, that's sweet. Nice healing. All right, where's the other one? <laughs> Shit, bro, they took a pretty big tumble. Hey. Oh, this is the healing. Form, man. All right. We get them down, probably to the river, eh? Feed some eels. Get the back stakes, back legs, front legs, and maybe neck chops if they're not fucked. Yeah. I'll give you a hand. Alright, so we got the back legs off both, uh, front legs off one because the shot went through the front legs of one. Back stakes up as far on that neck chops as we could go, and a bit of flat. So we're pretty stoked. We almost run out of meat. We're gonna get back to camp, set up. We got lamb chops and sirloin steaks. Yeah, boy. We're glassing our way out, out of the valley. Back to camp. Put a couple of deer up there. It's just that big, after the raw flush, eh? They're all out feeding. Cause that down there definitely would have been getting packed. Oh, God. What a fucking massive day. <sighs> three o'clock. Till three o'clock, we shot a deer. What's the time now, bro? 530. 5.30, we just made back to camp. And look at it. Oh, man. Let's get this meat out of our packs. Epic setup. We got these lead lens, uh, what are they? Lanterns, yeah, eh? Like ML fucking sevens or something. Look at this camp setup. You can't really see it though, eh? True. Damn. I might have to just brighten this fucking whole thing up with a torch. Oh. Yeah, now you can see it. I think I'm good in here yeah, now. I'll come out. Come out of the cooking a meal. <laughs> come out of the Hilton in the eh? That's so mean. I mean, you can't really see how mean it is, bro. It just looks like a big pile of rubbish. <laughs> New York style scotch. Extra fresh. With the umami sauce. <clears throat> Damn, that's a mean bush feed, eh? Fuck yeah. Because fuck them beehives. Yeah. Coffee, yeah, boy. Mean day. Oh, look at that. Waking up from bed straight into glassing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy, man. Right, what have we got? Probably two and a half or three hours out. Be three, eh? Yeah. Fuck. Sure. 
We just got soaking wet. <laughs> Anywhere you move, bring it up. Yep. 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 Just clean up all the condensation. <laughs> Bro, you wake up in the morning. Fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Made it back. Two and a half hours. <laughs> got the meat. Is it optimistic bring this chili bin? But we might do that every time, that's fucking mean. Shoo! Two and a half hours. We went. <laughs> that wasn't easy, that was hard as fuck. Maybe easy for you. <laughs> Up and over the back of there is this nice as valley. <sighs> might end up full driving down here next time going into the back. Yo, we back. Ha. You right, Mev? Not too tired, Gil? Good Gil, Mev.